So number three in the four S's of self is self-compassion. Self-compassion is so important when we're healing or when we've been through difficult times or when we're struggling in life or going through a change. So self-compassion is about recognising that as human beings, we all go through difficult times and you're not alone. You are not the only one going through this. But it's also being mindfully aware of where you are in your life and how you're feeling and being compassionate with yourself about that. So having compassion for difficult feelings, having compassion for grief, having compassion for the fact that you feel guilty, having compassion for yourself that you're angry with something that's going on or compassion that you feel sad about something. So just being really nurturing and kind to yourself and compassionate with yourself. And that also can build compassion for other people as well. And as we become more compassionate with ourselves, we can become more compassionate with other people. But self-compassion has really helped me in my healing journey. Just understanding that, you know, things have been difficult at times, but it's okay and I can get through it. And just being allowing myself the time. So allowing myself to take a day off, allowing myself, allowing yourself to take the time that you need. If you're burnt out at the moment, be compassionate with yourself. You know, work is tough sometimes. And if we've got external things going on at the same time, it can be really, really difficult and we can get burnt out. We can get burned out. So just be really compassionate with yourself as you would with someone else. <laughs> 